Okay, so first with pesto, we're going to take two bunches of basil, as you can see here, and we're going to put these into a cold water bath cold water. Uh, to get rid of any sand or dirt that may be in right. your, pe your basil. Take the rubber bands off. We did. Oh. You want to put both of them in there at the same time? Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, are we going to use both? Yeah. The yeah. recipe is two bunches, right? Yeah, okay. So we're going to use both. Yeah. I think I need more cold water. Yeah, cold water. And then kind of swish it around so we get all the sand off. Okay. Okay, and then you can... Uh, wait a minute. Hold on. I'm oh, holding. Okay. Stay there. I'm holding. Then you drain it. Put it okay. all in there. And then soak it again. Yeah, just yeah, just swish it around and then swish and put it in the colander. Okay. No, 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 no. Just with your hands. Lift oh, it just out. lift it out. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Put it in the colander and then wash it again. Okay. I mean, take the colander, put it over to the side, and then do it again because you want to make sure that you get all the sand out. Cold water. It's cold. So how many cloves of garlic do we use, Nani? What? How many cloves of garlic do we use? I used a whole head. You put the whole head for the two for bunches? The, yeah, the two, yeah. Okay. I use a lot of garlic. I don't know, maybe you don't want as much. No, I just want to make sure, yeah. Nani, that we're putting yeah, in what, you, right. what you, you're doing. Because I think I have only, I only ever put like four or five uh, cloves in. Uh, but if you're, but if, if what, how you make it is, this is how you make it, this is what we want. Well, we used to be quite uh, garlic. Uh, where's Stephanie? She's in the restaurant. I want to put her to work here. It's a tedious part of making pesto. Because there's a lot to it. Okay. Tell her just to clean I didn't think I was recording. It's okay. Oh. Okay, so now we've, we're putting in approximately two bunches of spinach, or spinach. Basil. Cut. Basil. Basil. Well, I know. I'm going to say it again. <laughs> okay, so now we're putting in approximately two bunches of basil into right. the blender after we've washed and cleaned it in the cold water bath. Yeah. And uh, if you need be, uh, we can keep some of the stems aside if we think we need a little bit more because you can add the stems and it won't really disturb the flavor of the the pesto uh -huh. then you put the garlic in and so we have basically what was a full uh, bulb of garlic uh, which looks to me about I don't know two it's four a, six ten cloves it's a head of garlic right Stephanie's doing a fine job. I'm sure she is. Okay, now we're wrapping up putting the uh, basil. Okay, basil in. 
Okay. okay, so at this point, we're going to take all of our heads of garlic, right. cloves of garlic. That have been cleaned. Cleaned, peeled, yeah. and those are going to go right in the top of the blender. Okay, then we add olive oil. Olive oil. Just enough so that it can it can uh, revolve. Okay, so we're going to put in enough oil quite to kind of... Quite a bit. Quite a bit. You tell me when. Well, wait a minute. Let's just go like this. Okay. You tell me whoa. Go, go. 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 Now let's check to see if it'll revolve. Okay. So it's probably like a half a cup. It was six one thousand. See if it'll revolve. And what are you blending? Just chop or chop. Chop. Then I usually get it. When you get your spatula. Push it down, yeah. Okay. okay. Maybe it will just, just, yeah, start revolving and then use this with your right hand and press the button with your left. I need more? Yes. Okay. Just keep putting it okay. until it'll revolve. Try it again. Okay, so you need to make sure that your basil is blended pretty fine. Can you... Um, and the garlic is in there. You can see on here that it's nice and fine. fine. Okay. It's nice and fine. And that your garlic's all blended. Okay, so now... Now, I usually... Now, you said we only use one of these for the... Muffin, one muffin can. Right. So, shall I thaw out one that I have, or or do you want to use it from here because this is the one you made? Okay. So now we're gonna put it about three quarters. Now normally you would put the saran wrap in here, so you could freeze it later. But we're just showing you uh, about how much this is gonna make. Yes, enough. Yeah, I want to see how many. Does it still look all finely? Yes, it's nice oh, I'm and dripping it. It's okay, just keep pouring, huh? Does that annoy the video? No, no it's, it's fine. That's, that one's not full. You just keep going until you... Yeah, that's not, that's not even going to fill that up. Can you just pour it? Yes, I can Thank just you. pour it. And then you get your spatula and you scrape out. Okay, and so this is probably going to yield somewhere between four and five muffin tins, depending on how much olive oil you probably ended up using right. uh, to make this. But you can see that's that's giving us about five tins. Yeah. Now that we've uh, have our pesto sauce ready to go, now we're going to mix in uh, to prepare it for pasta, which is going to be butter and olive oil and and cheese. So this is a two-batch pesto, so we're going to use 
uh, two sticks of butter. And that's one for each batch, typically. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so you're going to put that butter into the bowl, right? I put it in there. But then maybe that's no, not... So should we put that in here? We will eventually, yes. Yes. Okay. Make sure you get all your butter. Because <laughs> Noni doesn't waste anything. What's good to be not wasteful? <laughs> okay. okay. Then what's next, Noni? Okay. Better put this in there. Well, see if you can break that up a little bit. Oh, yeah, they're really soft. Yeah. Put that in there. She has one. Here, I got one. Oh, okay. Put that in there. Did we put salt and pepper in here? No, we did not. Not yet. Okay. Go ahead, scrape it out. No, hold it. No. Oh. There you go. Now you got it. Can you see that, honey? Yeah. It's okay. Oh, put that in Fine. Wow, it is really raining. Yeah. <laughs> so you will all That's come out fine. of there. Now wait. Let's open. hold on to it. Okay. Like you know, uh, CJ, downstairs over the stove, mm -hmm. there's pepper. Okay. There's a box of pepper. Okay. Okay, Turn so we just box. added maybe a teaspoon or so or of salt. salt. I know you just for feel, you don't know it, but I'm just trying to gauge how much salt that was. So. Probably about a teaspoon. Maybe a little I more. I think a little more. A little, a little more. more. But then I usually taste it. So you want me to mix it? Does it well, matter yet? We got, yeah, that's okay. This? Yes. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. <laughs> Keep stirring. I'll try to mash it. Yes. Yes. Yes, this would be like two frozen ones. See if it's salty enough. Oh, yeah. Plenty. Isn't this fun? <laughs> <laughs> I've never actually blended it together before, so I wanted to watch it. How you good, do it? Good, that's fine. That's See, fine we're doing all this for you, CJ. I know. So that we can pass these recipes be... down to you and you can pass them down to your children and they can pass them down to their children and it'll so on all, and so it'll forth. It'll be all on me one day. <laughs> it'll right? be all on you one day, buddy. When you're all old and cranky like Grandpa Gary. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> good for you. Old and cranky like Grandpa Gary. <laughs> okay, so now that we have that mixed. Yeah. Now what's next? The cheese? Yeah, we gotta I think put so. a cup at least two cups. This is two yeah, this is double. So. so but this is two cups, right? No, you have to measure it out. I'm gonna have to measure it, okay. Do you need a cup thing? There it is. That's it. Here's a cup thing. Thank you, buddy. 
Okay. Okay. So we're gonna add this cheese here. Hold on, it's got lot, got quite a bit of flour in it. I think it's got cheese. Oh well, okay, it's got cheese or flour in it. I wasn't sure, so I mix it out. Wait. So we're gonna take this cheese here, which is Parmesan, dry Parmesan and dry Monterey Jack blended together. Yes. But you can use regular Parmesan. Whatever. If whatever you need have. Whatever you want. So we're gonna put two cups. Go over the just, right, just go, go over this, the top. Go over here. And so we're gonna do two cups. So hello. Stay over the bowl. That way if it spills it goes into the extras. Extras just That's good. That's okay, good. there's one. There's one. And this is fresh. We had this blended right at the delicatessen. That's what he said. Several hours ago. Oh yeah, we watched Excuse him me. take that giant cheese wheel. Mm -hmm. yeah, well, not giant, up, but fill it up good. Okay, that's that should do it. Okay, put that. We'll use that to uh, when we when we mix it. So you gotta break up your little cheese balls. Oh my gosh, that smells so wonderful. It's good. It's good when it's all fresh, like it's fresh basil, it's freshly oh, grated yeah. cheese. Oh, absolutely. It's perfect. I'm thinking, you know, it just doesn't get any better than this. We're making it with noni, oh, which is course. even the most best That better. way you have memories. Mm -hmm. Plenty of salt. A little too much. I'm hoping that now the water isn't as salty. Mm. That'll be all right. Okay. Oh, that's yummy. Okay, so now, do we need to add more oil, or do you, think you it's good do you only it add is? that if you if it's? We did put oil in there, didn't we? No, no, not, not in this. No, we, we didn't we yet. We not put it when we made the pesto the in the blender. We oh, put oil, yeah. but in this right here, we didn't put oil. Well, we better put a little more oil. Okay. And so you add some more oil to kind of give it some more flavor. What's the consistency we're going Yes. Or what, what is the consistency we're going for? Yeah, because just a second ago, it seemed awfully thick. And this seems a little better. It's a little more better. Cre creamier. Yes, this is a little creamier. That's, that was much like, better. Uh, I'm sure that probably cut out some of the salt too. It wouldn't taste as salt. Yeah, because of. Uh, okay, so after we have it mixed, then basically what you're going to take with this is you're going to mix um, about a, uh, a half. If it was one batch, you would mix half, half a cup of pasta water. Well, you put half. Uh, now, don't be recording until I think it's the consistency that I could spread it over the pasta. Okay. So I don't know how much that is. Okay. So how much pasta, we sh you should reserve a good amount of pasta water. You don't want it to all go down the drain. I usually put the pasta water before I drain. So you scoop out the pasta water. water into here. And into make, here. Make this the consistency that I that want. Wants. Okay. Then you drain the pasta. Gotcha. But then we got to cook the potatoes yet. Right. Okay. No, Stephanie's going to do it. What am I doing? Okay, we'll bring this over here for now. Oh, you have it or I have it? I don't know who has it. I have it. Okay, now you got to add some of the pasta water. So you're going to add your pasta water because it's starchy. At the top, yeah. That's right. And you're going to add enough water to make this into a sauce. Make it into the consistency to spread over the pasta. So right now we've added one ladle to one batch of pasta or pesto. That's enough for now. Okay. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I think it's fine. I do too. So one ladle. You should measure and see how much that is with the measuring cups. I know. Where's the measuring cup? There's a glass one. They're here. They're here. Where's our pitcher there? This. I just I brought it out. There. I'm wondering if one ladle's 
you mean put the whole tray in them? Oh, it's a ladle. That's not. I, I knew that the cup is too much. Yeah, one ladle is. Put two two ladles Maybe and a see. Third. No, a second at least and Christ see how it goes. Tap water just goes in here, right? Yeah. Not crazy or anything. Yeah, tap water. This yeah. is a half. So everything tastes okay? Yes. Okay, good consistency? Yes. Okay. So we have our consistency. Yeah. Which is good there. Is this, gonna... is this cheese? Mm -hmm. Yes. So we're going to sprinkle cheese into the bowl. You've done it before, so that's recording. So you'll hear my voice. <laughs> okay, so all of this into there. Yes. Okay, so no layering, just all of it in. Yes. In here. Yes. Get yourself a nice big pasta bowl. Okay. Absolutely. Okay, so we got Can that. You come over here. Add the cheese. Okay, so we're gonna add cheese. And the pesto. So we add cheese, sprinkle cheese on there now. No, with your no. hand. Okay, with my hand. Like this? There. All right. Oh, what she could tell. That what, more? You're Italian. Yeah. Okay. No, then we use some more later. Okay. Now. Oh, you're, he's, she's taking. Yeah. Careful. She's taking a picture. So. You got a, you got a ladle, ladle it. Ladle. There. So we're our ladle. So get your ladle. And we're just going to ladle it. Onto the pasta. Just like this? All over. All over. All over. Daga drentu. Daga drentu. Okay, then you come around. You do this. You go. So a couple ladles. Under, underneath. Under. So that everybody gets pesto. So you just kind of push it in. Keep, keep. Now oh, you spilled something. All right, I'll get it. <laughs> so we're just kind of moving it into the keep, middle? Yeah, keep. Uh, so that so everybody, all the all the pasta gets pesto. Okay, all the then pasta. Then you keep adding so you're until kind of fold it in. Yes. Mixing it up. And get it all in there because there's a lot of white ones there yet. Okay. Oops. Oops. Well, that happens. You got you. <laughs> okay. Then you gotta add more pesto. Okay. Not no cheese more yet. More cheese. More cheese. Yeah, sprinkle more cheese. More cheese. Good. Now you okay. add more pesto. More pesto. Catch, catch the, the white ones as much as possible. Like okay. over here and over here. Make because, sure there's no whiteies. No, because we got to mix them up, boy. And then we get the ladle. What do I do with that ladle? I have the ladle. No, I mean the, the spatula's over here, honey. Spatula. It's right here. Yeah, I don't even know what they're called anymore. Okay, so what we're gonna <laughs> scrape it out? Oh, absolutely, but over the pasta. Okay, let me get that off there, huh? Yep. Oh, absolutely. We need all the pesto we can get. Okay. Did they set the table? Yes. They put napkins and everything. Yes. Yes, honey. Everything's ready to go. Good, good boy. Okay, so we're gonna get that in there. Well, first, mm, first uh, get, get the spoon and catch the white ones. Okay. No, I mean from the All there. All right, gotcha. Use, use this if you have to. Okay. Because that spatula isn't working as good as a spoon. All right. No, because see, now you're going too much in one spot. Okay. Catch, catch it. There you go. And go, I'll catch all the white ones. Drento. <laughs> then finally you use your spatula to clean it out. Okay. <laughs> Scrape it out real good. <laughs> oh boy, you're gonna hear that voice in there when you play it back. I'm not saying nothing. <laughs> well, okay, that should do it, I hope. That's that's a good job. Good okay, job. Enough pesto. And we mix it again? Yeah, keep going underneath. Go like this. 
No, plan to like this. Okay. There, now you got it. Potatoes in there yet? They're all in there. Are they like are they sliced? Mm -hmm. Or like chunks? And they're sliced and they're broken up. Okay, how's that look? Pieces, so. Now oh, more cheese. Well, okay. you got to use a little more of this, I'm afraid. You think so? I might. Yeah, I think so, because some of those are too white. I'm sorry, but maybe you can't That's take okay. it home. Yeah, you make it when you go home. All right, so and where's the, the whitey? white stuff. Where's the whitey? Well, show me what you think the whitey is, okay? And here. You gotta, you gotta really. Otherwise, you're not gonna, it's not gonna be good. We need spoons. No. We just need forks tonight, right? Yeah, because, uh, yeah, that looks Can better. Can I put this now, on the table? I'll give it. Mmm. Uh, yeah. Should we get a spoon yeah, for this? That would be great. Scoop. Should we get one of these? Scoop. Or is it bigger? Well, I'm checking the drawer. See if you can find anything that's a little bit bigger. Like, there, you there you go. There you go. Because today is a pest today. Where's the fagasa? What you do with the fagasa? Make sure all those noodles get some pesto, otherwise somebody's going to be cheated. <laughs> we don't want to cheat anybody. That would be awful. Well, you know when you Oh, get look how cheesy that's getting. Oh, well, that is so bad. Yeah, fabulous. but when you get home, you're going to have to make more pesto. That's okay, honey. We don't mind. This was for tonight. This is special. This is special. Okay, scoop. Let me see that. Let me see this. Let Noni scoop her. And yeah, Noni doesn't see good anymore. Yeah, I've never had potato pesto. Good. Unless I'm just totally forgetting. make it when you go home, I'm afraid. See, some of these are still white. You think that because of the type of pasta it is? That could be. Well, the tallurini naturally would absorb it right. more. These are big, poofy. I think it looks awesome. I think it looks incredible. What'd you say? I think it looks incredible. Oh. I'm ready to eat it. I hope. Yum, I'm ready. I'm starving. See, Noni, I think yeah, that you looks great. Where I get my Where's perfection the, from? Oh, here it is. From your perfectionist grandmother. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> Noni wants her food to be perfect, and I don't blame if was, her. If it was me doing this, she'd be like, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Who? <laughs> you. I would not. Do you get basilico in Las Vegas? Do you get basil in Las Vegas? Oh yeah, just it's not easy to find in in, in bunches the in way bunches. you can find it. Well, maybe you have to buy the pesto in the. Isn't there an Armenino that makes pesto? A who? Yeah, there's plenty. Armenino there's, there's is like in the dough. freezer section, oh. though. I think. I'm sure there is. But we refuse to do. But it's not as good as yours, Noni. Yeah. It's not as good as the homemade you kind. You just know what's the right thing to say. <laughs> well, we've tried pesto everywhere. You're very diplomatic. We have tried pesto in like every Italian restaurant we've ever been to, and none of it is like yours. None of it. It is not the same. Yeah, you be sure to say that. I know. Because Seriously? I need all the... I don't know now. You see, maybe you can clean it better than I can. See, Noni thinks she need all that. Okay. 
Good? Very good. Okay, now get a serving spoon. Okay, start serving. Can this go on the table now? Absolutely. The table is...